The team coming in now need extra support today because they didn't know they were appearing today until just yesterday when we had to withdraw one of the teams. So they're a last minute substitute. They were the next ones on the list of uh, qualifiers. So very good luck to them. So these are our smooth miniature Dachshunds. We've okay. seen them. So we've got two lots of uh, Dachshunds in the competition today. We had the, uh, the long-coated ones just in a moment ago, and now the smooth coats. So it just goes to show that you can train all breeds of dogs, and in fact, you should train all breeds of dogs. No matter what the breed, it should be under some degree of training. It stimulates them as well as keeps them under control, and it's great fun if it's done right. If you want to know more about the obedience competition, you can visit the Kennel Club website. And there's stacks of information on there if you want to get a team together yourselves. And next into the ring is our second Daxon team. This time the smooth coat variety. This is Team Mini Mayhem and they were drafted in only over the last day or two. They're just setting the scent area up and the scent article matching the team uniform. It looks like such a big area when you've only got little legs like that, doesn't it? But they're not delicate dogs, these Dachshunds, are they? No, but they do have this little stubborn streak. I think this one's thinking, I'd rather have gone to bed. I didn't want to do this one. The other hand, they're just encouraging the dog a little bit more. And the calling steward just giving a little bit of advice to the handler. Just to make sure that the dog succeeds. Brilliant. He said, is that what you wanted me to do? Or why didn't you explain it? But the dog just a little bit worried about the environment then. Remember, this team haven't been practicing for this competition because they didn't know they were even in it until yesterday. So that was a really good job. So the next exercise is the center bed exercise.
Looks like a sleeping bag, that bed, it doesn't does, it? It does, doesn't it? <laughs> Cute. <laughs> I think we'll need to check this in case the dog disappears. Now, I would have lost the bet had I put money on that dog going to the bed. Yes. This is part and parcel of the breed because... Yeah, there it is. <laughs> when they work, they work at um, distant direction under the direction of the hunters. So they have the ability to think for themselves. Sometimes it's not a good thing if your dog starts <laughs> thinking. But he definitely looks like he's enjoying his time at Crufts anyway, he doesn't he? He definitely it? is. The dog stopping in the down position on the handler's command. And then a little game to reward the dog. A toy's nearly as big as him. It is, isn't it? Or her, her, beg your pardon. So the last exercise then for this team is the retrieve. Well, considering this team didn't know they were going to be doing this 24 hours ago, can we have a huge round of applause? You did wonderfully, ladies. And your gorgeous little dogs.